Today we'll be installing Smart LCT on our Windows computer. So you head over here to Novastar, Novastar.tech website. I'm sure you should be familiar with this. We are going into the download section. Move on down there to software. And so then we're looking for here, no smart LCT. I keep going to say Nova LCT. If you're interested in a tutorial on this, there'll be a card in the top corner on how to get that on. But today we'll be focusing on smart LCT. So because this one will not be available, it's not available yet, we'll release in a few days. We'll be doing this version, it'll work exactly the same for that version there. So let's download it to our desktop. As you can see here, this is going to take an hour because my internet connection is absolutely terrible. So I'll see you back there. So wait for that to download. Here we are. Now we have the zip folder on our desktop because that's where we chose to download it. If we go into this, just extract all to the desktop. You got the one folder in there, LCT setup. So let's go and open that up. You get the prompt which says, Do you want to trust this? You just press yes. That's why my screen went black. And then it'll go into this. So you say yes, I want to accept. You can review this if you like, but yeah, you know. Next, choose your destination, so just files program. Next, create desktop and install. It'll go through the installation process there. This should take, shouldn't take long at all. Close this down. It'll run some scripts. So these are the scripts. There's also some frameworks you have to install, similar to Nova LCT, so that it can see stuff in the background. And this is the framework there. Finish installing. So launch and read me. I don't want to read that, so let's. And it will boot into the software if i'm correct this doesn't have the full functionality that nova lct has at the moment but the newer versions the ones coming out uh version 5 and the like i think it's version 5 uh should have more functionality going forward and i'll have videos on them as they come out so subscribe if you're interested you can see it's all working you can see the service is connected so all the background stuff is uh working properly we have our project here so this is what i've made previously this is what the interface looks like if you're interested i'll have a tutorial video on what all this does what you can do at the moment what is going to be in the future if you're interested in that press the subscribe button leave a like on the video and i will see you in the next one